Hello, 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 everybody. Today we are doing the Road to Gold with the M4. Now, right quick at the beginning, I do want to say that there's a lot of ways that people have done Road to Gold throughout the years, um, such as unlocking it, um, like having a series for specific guns, or having one video per gun where they already have the gold camo unlocked, uh, and they're just talking about what's best on it. We're going to be doing a bit of a mix between the two. So what I've done is, as you can see, I have the scales, desert hybrid, dark leaves, and urban renewal camos already unlocked. The M4 is already max level, but for the completionist, and with PC, it's a little glitchy here. Let me see if I can get over. Uh, we need three kills without dying ten times with the M4. So in the games that we play today, we're going to be going to complete those last ten uh, and I've got three different classes here with the M4 to use, one of which is a recoiled reduction class, one is a rushing class, and one is like a mid-range class. So with that said, let's go ahead and get it straight into the first game. Alright, so we're on Albagra Fortress, and I'm almost certainly mispronouncing that, and we're going to be using the mid setup. We might swap back and forth between the games, depending on how I feel like the game is going. I mean, I'm not going to be saying necessarily the specific attachments, because everyone is going to have different attachments and everything unlocked at this level, so it's a little bit inconsistent, but you can mostly kind of pick your attachments around what you're going for. Uh, let's see. Ooh, the aim is a little rough. I'll, and I'll talk. There's so much I want to talk about in this video. Um, but so for this one, obviously, we're doing a mixture of like aim down sights time because that's very important because this game does take literally years, it feels like, to be able to aim down sights a lot of the time. Uh, but then also recoil reduction because if you go full ADS, well, your gun's not going to be very stable. Oh, can I get out of this guy? He's in the window. Let's see. I don't, I don't want to rechallenge. Oh, no. We've got someone on point. Let's just... Or not. We'll just die. That's another thing. I'm not particularly good at this game. I understand that, you know, I might be getting some people who are watching from Modern Warfare 2 who have never seen... Oh, that's a Claymore. Uh, who have never seen my normal content. Uh, I'm mostly a COD Zombies player. Multiplayer is not necessarily my strongest suit, but I do really enjoy it. Uh, and nowadays with, you know, good old skill-based matchmaking and everything, it, the games are all... You're gonna go around neutral in most of the games anyways. Um, I, I am a lot better than in my first video. I'm like level 40 now, um, so I'm doing pretty okay a lot of the time. But I've, uh, I'm, I'm just excited for this series, man. I definitely plan to be doing it with just about every single gun. Uh, or quite literally every single gun because it's a pretty fun game. I have a few issues with it. I think um, Infinity Ward has punished rushers pretty harshly. Oh, I hate the shock thing uh, because of like the time it takes to aim down sides. But a lot of people also just haven't been optimizing attachments and leveling up everything. A lot of people don't know the best way is to level things up. I was playing with a few of my friends last night. Dude, it felt like the 2010s all over again. But we had about six of us. Uh, so we had a full party and we were just playing all the different game modes having fun. Uh, and they're all around my level. You you know, uh, in the 30s to 40s, and there's a lot that people don't know because this COD is so different than all of the others and everything. Uh, also, if you haven't watched my videos before, uh, it's much more of a commentary style, um, not more, not super, you know, cut heavy. Um, it, we just hang out and play a video game and talk. That's that's what I like to do. <laughs> oh, where did this guy go? Hold up. Ah, oh, dude, chasing is such a bad idea. Chasing always gets me in just such a miserable situation. Uh, but, oh, we also need to be going for three kills without dying. I guess I haven't really been thinking about that. Now, I don't think you can stack those, so if you go on a six kill streak, um, sorry, the suppressor there really messed up. If you go on a six kill streak, will that count as two? Because I think if you went, like, merciless or ruthless in previous games, whenever it was, like, bloodthirsty medals, you would, you would get it. So I assume it might work the same. We'll see. Three kills without dying shouldn't be too hard. I am 99% sure. I don't know if in previous multiplayer games it's ever been three kills. I know in the older ones it was always Bloodthirsty, which is five kills. But I imagine because of the, you know, heavier skill-based matchmaking and everything, they expect people to have a harder time getting those Bloodthirsties. Um, plus, the camo system in general in this game is like ten times less grindy. Ah, oh, unfortunate. Uh, because it's a very simple unlock system. You just have to get the gun to, you know, one level below the maximum level for it. And then you have some very basic challenges. I hate those shock things. I, oh. um, you have some very basic challenges which are like, oh, get double kills or get kills from behind or just get 50 kills. It's very, very simple. This guy's going to rush in here now. Watch. No? The amount of... Oh, my teammate probably just killed him. Uh, the amount of self-control on that guy. I hear them. Where? Where? I also have, a, like, an issue of visibility in this game. Um, I also think statues are people, so I will just shoot at those out of nowhere. 
Uh, but as I've been playing it more, I, I do really enjoy it. My gut reaction to this game was I hated it so much because I've been playing a lot of Overwatch and, of course, very, very different games. Because uh, Overwatch, you can get shot for 10 minutes and never die, especially as tank. Uh, in this game, you get shot in the head twice because there's a crazy headshot multiplier, it feels like, in this game. Um, and it's just insane. There's so much to talk about. Because time to kill is crazy, weapon system, um, the unlock system is crazy, but I do love it. The attachment system, uh, crazy, but I love it. And I think you also have to look in light of it, of there's not a prestige system anymore, so you're not continuously unlocking everything. And, you know, how often in Black Ops or whatever, on Double XP Weekend, or uh, whatever game you play, Double XP Weekend, you would just go on the playlist of the smallest maps and you would just run around with an SMG or a shotgun, and you would go through like three prestiges in a weekend, but you only used one gun. Uh, so now, you know, it actually forces you to try different guns, try out the diversity of everything. Because uh, I'll be honest, in other CODs, I'd never use... Uh, the last time I actually used an LMG in a COD game, I, I don't even know. Uh, but in this game, obviously, if you want to unlock certain attachments, or if you want to do this, that, or the other, you're going to have to try out different things. For instance, if you want to unlock an attachment on the M4, I'm pretty sure you have to, like, upgrade a sniper uh, to get a, a pretty good laser sight that just reduces uh, your aim down sights time and has no negative. There's also the issue of, like, you know, COD Mobile has, like, super detailed weapon stats, uh, and it shows you, like, a, a diagram of a body, how many shot sticks to kill, and in this game we have little terrible graph, uh, and then also, what are you doing, bro? Also, weapon tuning, uh, being disabled is honestly crazy. Where, where did he go? He went this way, right? Did he kill himself? He killed himself. Okay. Uh, you obviously have, you know, so much unfinished stuff. There's no challenges. The, the calling cards are, haven't been fully implemented. There's no barracks. It's just insane. I, I don't understand how they could release this game in the unfinished states. And not to say it's not fun, because it is. But man, why? Why? They literally took guns and maps out of beta. Like, the Honey Badger was in the game, and they just removed it. Which is crazy to me. Where is this guy? He's got to be in the truck, right? Yeah. Ooh, thank you, teammate. <laughs> Let's see. I've not been paying too much attention to my kill streaks here. But I'm hoping we get the gold. I, I, in the videos, I want to, you know, swap between all the classes and everything and then be able to go to... I'm trying to figure out where the enemies are. And then be able to go to... Uh, the gold camo, and be able to show off the gold camo. I want it to be, you know, probably three-fourths of the video is trying to get the gold camo, and then about a fourth of the video is just showing it off and summing things up. We're also going to swap weapons, not weapons, but weapon loadout after this, just to try a uh, different one to make sure we, we do, we are able to show them all off. Um, let's talk about weapon experience, about leveling up weapons, because that's a thing that a lot of people seem to have uh, trouble with understanding. And basically the way it works is whenever you see points pop up on your screen, that experience also goes to your weapon. So if I get a kill with a Simtex, and I'm dead now, of course, but I just got a kill, I heard it, and I spawn in, I get 150 XP, that XP goes to my weapon. If I shoot down a rocket with a, or a UAV with a grenade, with a rocket launcher, and then I quickly swap back to my main weapon, oh, unfortunate, and I quickly swap back to my main weapon, then uh, whenever it shows up that 100 XP, I will get that on my main weapon. There's so many ways to like cheese the system uh, and be able to get weapon on xps that you want or what things that can maybe be a little bit more difficult traditionally to get experience for so it's it's clever um it also means like s and d you know I, I always worried in previous games leveling up weapons uh, for instance i'm thinking of black ops 2 specifically here because that was the card i put the most time in you would get the elimination medal which gave you the 500 xp um but the kill itself will only give you 100, and I don't know how well, like, metals actually correlated to weapon XP. Um, of course, weapon XP was not nearly as big of a deal back then. But, it's just curious, I suppose. I am curious about whenever there's double XP tokens, because there's also double weapon XP. Do you still only get the base XP on your weapon? Or, like, <laughs> I don't know how it works. It's crazy. Uh, I also noticed an SD in this game, it seems you only get 300 points per kill. And I'm going to assume that that is because there's more rounds than there used to be. Because correct me if I'm wrong, but it used to be best of four. And now it's first to six. So there's way more rounds. So I do see why they would reduce... Oh, unfortunate. Why they would reduce the amount of kills needed and everything. Or not amount of kills needed, but the amount of points given per kill. Because uh, that makes sense, I suppose. Oh. Is there tack mask in this game? I haven't looked around the perk system too, too much. I'm hoping there is. I also uh, played probably about... 80% of my time in this game. Probably a lot more than 
on controller. And right now I'm playing on mouse and keyboard. Because initially, uh, for one, I've, I've played mouse and keyboard for about the past five years, very seldom using a controller. Um, I don't like controllers and FPSs, but I heard the aim assist was really strong. And whenever I first used the controller, it felt pretty strong. But I would keep having these moments where I'm like, man, if I could just use my mouse and keyboard, I'd be able to, you know, easily snap onto them. I wouldn't have to worry about dealing with this. I feel so uncomfortable. My, my hands are literally hurting because my controller is very uncomfortable. Oh, uh, this is, this is embarrassing. Give me a second. No, bro, don't juke me like that. <laughs> okay. Anyways. So... I, I end up going back to mouse and keyboard and I immediately drop like a 50 and 18 game and I'm like, okay, you know what? I give the controller a try. I give it an earnest shot. The aim assist isn't as bad as everyone says it is. If you actually do test with it yourself, it's not that crazy. I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong. But I still just feel like mouse and keyboard. Where are you, brother? Where mouse and keyboard is just so much easier to work with and deal with. I do think anyone calling it like aimbot is just stupid and bad at the game. I, I can't imagine how... And you know, hey, maybe you're good at the game, and maybe you are just stupid. Because I'm sure that there are pro players who are, who are like, oh, it's aimbot. There's also pro players who think, I mean, not to get in the whole skill-based matchmaking argument. But spoiler alert, guys. Skill-based matchmaking has been in caught a very long time. Um, this is not something new. There are people making videos about it back in Black Ops 2. Truth be told, everyone's just whining. And that's the whole, that's the COD cycle in, in reality. The COD cycle isn't the new COD every year. The COD cycle is where you hate the COD of the year and then you like the COD of last year. Because um, people are just flat out silly. They don't understand what they're talking about. They don't do tests. They just spit and reiterate whatever their favorite YouTuber with a million subscribers and who's 16 years old taking 30 milligrams of Adderall every four hours told them. And it's fine if that's how you want to live your life. Um, but, you know, think for yourself. It's fine to have an opinion, as long as you test it out. If you hooked up a controller to your game, and you played around with the aim assist, and you actually played, you know, more than 10 games with it, and you think it's still crazy strong, then hey, you know what? You think it's crazy strong. I just can't stand people just spewing nonsense they heard from a YouTuber. Because let me tell you, a lot of YouTubers aren't accurate. I don't know anything. I'm just talking. I don't know jack squat. And some of you guys are going to come out of this probably saying, oh, you know, the aim assist isn't nothing, uh, because I'm giving my opinion on it. And you can't let yourself swayed be that easily. Come on, guys. <laughs> I don't know. That's one of my biggest issues with COD. It's just all the complaining. I think there's valid complaints, like the game being quite literally unfinished. I saw someone on Twitter being like, bro, just give them time. They'll add more maps. And I'm just thinking, my brother in Christ, COD used to launch with 20 maps. We have 10. They took guns out of the beta. They took maps out of the beta. It's crazy. Um, there's very valid criticisms, but then some are just, uh, you know, eh, whatever. It's the same way COD's always been. I think a lot of people just don't like COD anymore. I think I was in that group for a while. I think, you know, for about five year period, I just didn't like COD. I know people really liked Modern Warfare 2019. I hated Modern Warfare 2019. And I bet if I played it now, I would enjoy it. Because I'm just back into COD than, than I was. But I think a lot of people are just trying to relive the glory days, and they don't come back. It doesn't work like that. But, right quick, I don't want to have to go through minis and everything, so we went uh, 39 kills. Uh, we didn't play the objective maybe the most. But we'll see, uh, we'll check, actually, after this, how well we did, uh, how far we've progressed to gold. So we'll check that here in just a second. Uh, the M4 looks like a pistol. Another beautiful glitch. <laughs> Let's go to customize camo. So for gold, which we have to... It's stupid. We have to use arrow keys while hovering over. We have four out of ten already. So, yeah, we'll be able to get gold pretty easily in this video. Hopefully, we have a good map coming up next. We are playing Hardpoint, by the way. Hardpoint is uh, probably my favorite for just experience uh, and being able to play an objective and have people come around it and be able to get kills. It's a pretty good game mode. Uh, so, I will see you guys once we get into a game. Okay, I give up. I've joined three games in a row mid-game. We're just going to have to deal with it. I don't think it's that big of a deal. Uh, because we're on this map, I did choose the recoil reduction one, uh, the loadout I have, because it's actually has a lot of like really long, unfortunate, a lot of really long sight lines. Uh, what do you call it? It's pretty long range in several areas. You can just stay in the short areas, uh, but if I'm able to perform properly here. We should be able to watch these longer... Oh, I can't see anything, man. Anyways, I'm hoping we'll be able to stay at longer ranges and be able to dominate. Uh, the M4, of course, I guess I haven't talked about the weapon too much. I probably should. The M4, of course, um, has pretty good recoil on it. I mean, it's just your basic rifle, right? Everyone's seen, you know, the, the M... Where did you die from? 
What is it? Oh, I see him. He's just... Oh, he's back there in the... Come on. There we go. We've got a long shot for it. Very nice. Uh, but... I think I'm losing my track. The M4 is just a basic assault rifle. I don't know what to say about it, man. It has an okay time to kill. It has, it has okay range. It's just, you know, your basic... Overall, good to solve it. It's not particularly outstanding in anything. Personally, whenever I was leveling up, I didn't like it. it. Feels like a hit marker machine. Still feels like a hit marker machine. I like guns with a bit more oomph. I'm fine with having a bit of a slower fire rate in return, but I really just can't stand hit markers. Same reason I can't stand SMGs, man. I uh, I like to not hit hit markers, and I've gotten a few. What I do is in my off time, whenever I play, I'll get weapons to around max level, make sure I have the camos unlocked, uh, and then I'll leave the gold camo. For the video, so I've been playing around with a lot of different guns. And like I say, I've, I don't, I've not liked any of the SMGs too much. The SMGs just frustrate me um, because, and something I want to talk about, the aim down sights penalty in this game is ridiculous. To every corner, and I don't do it, of course, but every corner you go around, you should already be pre-aiming um, because it takes so long. See right there. The only reason we won that is because we were slightly aiming before him. Uh, because there's such a big penalty. It takes like almost a full second for me to get fully aimed down sights, especially with this class uh, being a lot of negative aim down sights. This one's all about recoil. I didn't care about mobility. I didn't care about aim down sights because I wanted to be able to use it at a range, which means if I'm not running around like a madman, I should. Unfortunate for this. Uh, the, the best shotgun sniper in the game right there. <laughs> Uh, but, as long as I'm staying at longer ranges, it should be okay. Now, of course, I'm probably not the best at that. I inherently just want to run in. I don't like holding angles. I feel like it's boring. I don't know what I'm getting hit from. That's fun. I do love getting hit by a flash and not being able to move for a full two seconds. <laughs> uh, what was it? Concussion, I guess? I've always thought, what if you have, like, uh, one of those... Okay. What if you have one... Oh, I love this map so much. <laughs> what if you have one of those turbo buttons on your mouse? So whenever you press it, your sensitivity goes up to like a million. So whenever you're concussed, you just press it. <laughs> what, what would happen? Is, is your like stuff hard locked? or This is... You die there because you're bad. I die there because I can't see through your skull, brother. Where, where was he? I have no idea where he's even gone. <laughs> what? Who's shooting at me? Also, a uh, glitch. There's so many glitches, man. I am rocking Escort Gunner, which of course I haven't got yet this game, but last night I was running VTOL, which is the same thing, and I, I would frequently get the VTOL because I kept forgetting to change it because I was using Control on PC. I don't know if it's a glitch with Control on PC because I can use the other stuff properly, the SAE, but I couldn't place my VTOL, so I would keep getting my VTOLs in games and I wouldn't be able to use them at all, and it made me so sad. I <laughs> see three hit markers to the head. Unfortunate. And I probably got, you know, the upper chest, not the head, but I just feel like in that situation, they should probably be dead. I feel like my bullets should probably deal more than 35 damage, especially because I have things on that, you know, increase effective damage range. This should be, by all means, quite the long-range little M4, and yet I don't feel that much of a difference. Now, of course, attachments do make a difference. That's not the point I'm making here. Why would I do that? What a bad call to throw a Simtex on. I know there's an enemy right there who could just push up on me while I'm... Because everything's... So, look how long it takes me to pull out the UAV. It takes like two, three seconds to pull out a UAV. In previous games, it's just like a quick click and you've got it, you know? Oh, I just saw the little dot. Now there's one to the side of me. I can't... I, I dash two. Again. I'm not the best. Looks like maybe because I did pretty okay last game, the skill-based matchmaking said, Hey, you know what we're going to do? We're going to make it to where you can't have fun. Because <laughs> that's how it goes, you know, you, you go average for a few games, you have one really good game, and then all of a sudden, you know, you're back to, you have a really bad game, and then you're back to the average. It's that little roller coaster they'll put you on. I'm going to go back to mid. I, I don't like how slow I feel with the the other one. I won't go the full rush one because the, the map is too long range for me to feel comfortable not being able to shoot anyone from even this distance with that gun. Uh, but I think it's also just aim down sights is so important and not being able to have that in this game or like if you don't have a gun with those attachments, you're just kind of screwed over all around. I also joined halfway through, so I guess I don't feel bad that I'm maybe not as high as everyone else on the score, uh, scoreboard. Oh, unfortunately, we only got the assist. I, I've gotten like one UAV this game, right? So, so we are not making a ton of progress with this mission. I need to maybe play a bit slower, play a bit smarter and just try to get my, my three kill streaks. I need to find tack mask. I rock the the grenade reduction one because everyone their mother throws grenades constantly. Uh, I, I also run the trophy system, which I do forget to pull out on PC. I I don't know, man. I can't see him. 
It makes me sad, and I'm probably just blind. I'll, I'll give it. I'm not good at the game. I'll stand by that, but I have fun with it. But man, I'm losing my mind at some stuff. There's always so many, and then I hit the bullets, and the bullets don't kill. It's like whenever I play Valorant. I'm typically the guy with the sniper, because I say, hey, I can hit one bullet. So I hope that bullet counts. Because uh, once once we get past that one bullet, I'm I'm in trouble. Where? Oh, the, 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 the gun in the sky. That's what got me. <laughs> uh, see, I didn't pre-aim there. He, started, uh, he was able to fire on me. I don't think it was reaction speed diff. I think it was... I could have watched the kill cam, I guess. So I would know, so I could learn from my mistakes. Nope, 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 nope. Not fighting a sniper at that range. Doesn't sound like the smartest idea. Where? Why are you head glitching? Why are you the way you are? Did you pay $70 to do that? I just, I just want it. I just want it. I just want it. Just one more. Right here. Got it. Okay, that's a three. Can we get another three? Same life, imagine. Here's the issue. I have like one mag left. Uh, so we are gonna, but don't worry, we got a full thing of ammo now. That is a shotgun blast to the head. I also <laughs> feel like SMGs are just outclassed by shotties because as an SMG, you want to be constantly in their face. I have a hard time using the at long range because I do feel like some of them, some of them are lasers, uh, but some of them just have insane recoil. And then I get a matchup, I guess, you know, the shotty's supposed to beat it and it's supposed to be an assault rifle, yada, yada. I get how it's supposed to work. But I just feel like I constantly lose those fights. Assault rifles feel by far the best to me. Um, with SMGs feeling by far the worst. I haven't used any of the LMGs yet, actually. Uh, but, I, but there's the one SMG. Or maybe it's not a rifle. I don't know. The Phoenix, the Phoenix crazy. I've picked that gun up a few times. I don't know if I have it unlocked yet or not. But I picked it up. And I go crazy with that thing. It, it just melts. I, I would love to see what a tier list of guns in this game are. Because uh, we're going to die so quickly here. Right there, right there, man. I knew it. I knew he was right there. Let's see. Let's see. That's a teammate. <laughs> oh, so we have the hard point. Enemy right there. Couldn't get him. Where are they coming from is my question, I suppose. I don't know. This way? Yes, no, maybe so. Come on. I do the radar. That's a thing to talk about. The radar in this game is not your average COD radar, in case you don't know. Anyone shooting will not appear on the map. The only way that you appear on the map... I thought he was... I was pointing at the screen there. I guess you can't see me pointing at the screen. I thought he was further back. I was looking at the radar. But the only way you can see enemies on the radar is during a UAV, um, unless there's a more advanced, higher kill streak like an orbital VSAT, which I don't know if there is or not. Uh, but it doesn't mean counter UAVs are very important. Ghost is very important, which of course is now why Ghost is an ultimate perk. I don't know if Simtex is count. Uh, I know they count for... Oh, let me reload. Let me reload. Just, just let me, let me, let me get one. I just want one. I just want, I just want one. One more. If the Simtex counted, then we just need one. I see him. I see him. I'm concussed. I'm concussed. Why? I, bro, you could have thrown down the trophy system while you were on the hard point. I guess I'm bad. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. I want to keep going further over. Uh, the sniper. The sniper shotgun, rather. I am going to cry tears, and we'll end it there. <laughs> we'll get gold. I'm not worried about it. Uh, oof. All right. Nope. You're in survivor. That's one. We have one. Careful. Watch out for the long range folk. That's two. I just need one more. I'm concussed. Please unconcuss me. If I get on this side of him, we should be okay. He doesn't see us. Three. Boom. Another one. We can also keep track just by UAVs, because UAVs are our three kill streak, I believe. I don't like the person who's using Survivor. I don't even know if I end up getting the kill there, but we should have made a little bit of progress. Uh, and we'll check it right after this game. We'll see how we did. Oh, dude, the game was so close. 247 to 250. What a shame. I guess I'm not staying on the objective whatsoever. But for joining in halfway through, 26 kills isn't too bad. But yeah, yeah, we'll see how, we'll see how we're making progress. 7 out of 10. Looks like one more game. Oh, my voice there. I'm so sorry. Uh, I think one more game and we'll have it. And then we'll do a game with the goal of just being able to show it off. And I've been having a lot of fun. I hope you guys are enjoying as well. Looks like we're in a lobby. I'm praying it actually... Oh, it's the car map. Anyways, I'm hope. Oh, my voice. <clears throat> oh, it's going to lag here. I don't know how... The game has this issue with loading in things. We'll, we'll keep it going, but I'm hoping the video doesn't get too messed up. But, I don't know what I was talking about. So, <laughs> we'll do mid on this map again. 
Sorry, I got distracted by something. Uh, we're we're going to do mid on this map. Uh, it's my favorite one I like to use. I don't like the... I mean, the rush one's good. I really hate the recoil reduction on one. I feel way too slow. I also hate this map with a passion. It, it's so ridiculous having all the cars. It's so silly. Oh, I also want to... I've gone positive in the past two games. I know you guys didn't get to see the end, uh, scoreboard with, this, with the deaths, but I have gone positive in both of the games. So I am giving myself a double thumbs up on that. Uh, but we need to be able to really focus in. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to maybe not be the the best teammate here. But I'm going to, once I get those three kills, I'm just going to leave the game. Uh, whenever I get the three UAVs, I'm going to dip on out just so we can make sure the video doesn't get too, too long. And we can use gold camo. Because if you get gold camo and then you leave, or if you get any camo and then you leave, it doesn't uh, penalize you at all. Nope, nope, didn't get the assist. There's going to be a guy coming that way. A little crazy. Looks like there might be one behind us. Where? Right there. Okay, that's two. Unfortunate. Maybe that was three. No, don't have a UAV. Or is a UAV a four kill streak? I think I'm I'm running hardline, but it's my ultimate. Okay, I only got two kills. Uh, so whenever hardline kicks in, that's whenever my UAV is a three kill streak. Got it. Because yeah, I, I do like running hardline. It makes me feel happy if I get a VTOL. You know, maybe I'm not getting it in the most legitimate way, but it, it brings my heart a little bit of joy. Where? Yeah, this, oh, I, that's why I love this map, is because of those cars, man. You throw a Simtex, all of a sudden you get a you get a quad feed, because the tr cars start an insane chain reaction. I, I thought it was on the car, and I was just going to lose it. Let's see. Oh, all right, they're going to be going that way. That's one. Should be right here. Two. Don't dive into trying to shoot. That time takes forever. And that's three. All right, so one out of three done. Two more. Two more. Let's see if I can get on another three kill streak here. Come on, come on. Where are they, do you think? I don't have a UAV yet. Looks like they're on hard point, but I don't... I don't see where we're spawning. I might have just missed it. Let's see if I can... Well, I don't know if a Simtex would count. I doubt it would, right? So we probably should not be going for the Simtex stuff. We should probably just be trying to shoot. So that's one. Let's see, can we get two? Where are they? Where are they? There he is. Ooh, was that a double? Yes, it was. Alright, that's another three. So we should just need one more three. Or did we just unlock gold? Because that little trophy system seems to mean you've unlocked something. But I don't know. It could have been something else entirely. We'll go for one more of the threes just to make sure. Oh, why? Why? Because, yeah, there's no way we've gotten three in this game. And we were at seven out of ten. I could call on my scorch. Let me see if I can... I don't like people who jump. I think that if you have spacebar bound to jump, uh, you should probably stop playing the game and just go try a different one. <laughs> I, I don't mean that, of course. That's obviously just a joke. I just think it's so sweaty and try hard. Also, I'm not fighting that angle. That seems silly to to fight that. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I will say, some of the rag offices in this game have been quite funny to see and deal with. I'm so... Why? Why, dude? Why do you pay $60 to do that? I don't get it. Do you not want to see the map? Or, or is that what you're content with? Or 70 It's not even 60 anymore. That's what I like to think, man. I like to think these people spent $70 just to go like this for the entire game. He'll come. He's going to come, guys. Right here. Right here. There's going to be someone right here. <laughs> it makes me lose it. Anyways, that's one. So we need two more. Uh, people should be coming through... I see him. He's like two bullets from death. Alright, one more, one more. He's gonna be coming right here. Pre-fire. Dude, I was pre-firing! You had a- what is that? Are you using this- oh, the shotgun. The shotgun. But it's on the shotgun. It looks like a shotgun. You think it's a shotgun. I wouldn't blame you. That's a marksman rifle. Um, that makes me lose my mind. I hate that gun so much. Not to be a, a negative Nancy, of course. It's just, yeah, that's COD, man. You just complain. Complain about the right things, though. <laughs> I'm not a hypocrite. I'm just, I'm just a dude playing game. I am losing it by how many double kills we've gotten, but we haven't been able to get another triple. I just want to see my gold camo. Please, game. That's a rocket. Um, Where do you think he is? Maybe they were in that little tunnel there. So we know there's an enemy around here. I just saw him, and I'm flash. Are they going to come through? I hate you! Let's see it. Let's see it. This is this gonna be that good old fashioned aim assist? Let's see. Let's see what you're doing here. You're jumping and yeah, you just lock on. I don't care about aim assist. I just think you're playing lame. But at least hey, at least you're 
playing the game and not sitting in a corner. I'll, I'll give you that one. I thought... Uh, I just want my last triple. That's all I want. Surely we get it this game, right? Surely we don't need to play another game. Also, who's shooting at me? There shouldn't be anyone behind me. This map is also, like, deceivingly long. It's really weird how long it is. Because you think, oh, there's no way the enemies can be spawning behind me. And then it's like they're all 20 minutes away from the objective. All right, two more, two more. Let's play safe. Let's play smart. Two more. We're going to go back this way. Try to get a good angle. All right, one more, one more. He's right there. Where, 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 where? No, don't throw some decks. Don't throw some decks. We're good. We're good. Just one. Just one. Where? Where? Ah, we did it. That should be gold. Uh, that was three, right? Yes, yes, it was. Okay, so after this death, we're going to back out. Leave game. Yes. Let's see. Do we have gold? I don't care about finishing out the match. I just want gold so we can show that off. Customize. Camo. Yes. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's go and put gold on all three class. It's such a silly way of doing it. Let's put gold on all three classes and we'll get into one last game and just be able to show it off. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to get into a map that I don't absolutely hate. But, right quick, I do want everyone just to be able to see me putting it on. Just because, just because, because I like it. I'm proud of myself. Very seldom have I gotten gold guns this early in a COD uh, game. Very seldom have I played a COD game this much, truth be told. But... I'm happy with it. So now that we got gold and everything, oh, look how pretty it is. All right, we'll go ahead and hop straight into a game. Every game is a match in progress, man. How far into it? How far into it are we? We are... Okay, okay. It's basically the beginning. I'm fine with this. I don't... What class I pick? I picked the mid-class? Oh, I wasn't sure what class I picked. I was trying to tell. Yeah, okay, we're using... Let's use Rush on this map, just because this map is giga close range. The smallest map in the game. Oh, look at that gun, dude. It's so pretty. I love the gold camo in this game. I'm really excited for Platinum. Uh, we will be, if I'm still playing this game, we'll be doing Roll to Gold, Roll to Platinum, um, where we just do the challenges for them. I, I think that makes the most sense. You know, there's Gold, Platinum... Uh, polyatomic, all these different challenges, so hey, why not make videos on them? I think it's fun. Uh, plus, you know, you get to see something cool in every video. You get to see someone unlock gold. Um, it just seems, it just seems fun. I, I, it, I enjoy watching a video. I, I like the 10 minute stats videos, right? I, I like watching, you know, something short, but if I'm watching, like, for gameplay and, like, for commentary, I don't want to watch a 10 minute video. It's like, I don't, I want to be able to put it on while I'm doing something and not have to worry about putting on a new video every 15 minutes. So why people listen to podcasts. I think of my videos, a lot of, it, a lot of commenters have said it as well, but it's like a little miniature podcast where I just talk. I'm also not maybe the most focused right now. I'm just happy we got gold. I was so worried I would start recording and it was going to take me like 10 games to get gold, uh, which I'm sure for some of these guns will happen. Uh, but there's also going to be no rhyme or reason, just so everyone knows, between what guns I go. It'll just be whatever I'm feeling. I think uh, one of the SM... No, I have a battle rifle. I have one of the battle rifles ready. So the next video will probably be a battle rifle one, unless I'm like, you know what, I really don't want to. And then I'm not going to be worried about it. Where were you? Where were you? I want to know. I want to know. Let me see. You were there. I didn't, I didn't see you. I didn't see the flare. I didn't look that way, I guess. Unfortunate. I am playing like terrible in my actual gold game. Oh, 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 please. I guess I'm using the rush one and I'm not rushing in. I'm just staying uh, behind. I should also be doing the pre-aim thing. I, <laughs> I saw the green laser. I was so confused. I need to be doing pre-aim. Oh, where? What? What did he die from? What's going on here? What is... Do they have like a landmine system set up? Why are there so many explosives right here? What is going on? This is crazy. I'm so confused. This is... This is Call of Duty, baby. <laughs> Let's try not to do so dog terrible. Um, play the game properly. It's hard to focus on. I'm so happy, though. <laughs> it really is. It's hard to take it seriously. Like whenever I play zombies, it's always whenever I feel like the most comfortable that I always take the down. Because I just start playing all silly. Let's see. We got it. I want to. I want to get some. I want to actually perform here. You know, maybe maybe the last game was supposed to be my good game. That's why I kept going on the kill streaks and everything. And in this game, they're like, no, this won't be the good game. I'm scratching my nose. So hopefully, it doesn't double back now. I hear you behind me. If I just, but that some tech still get him. No, he's run way too far off. I think I got a hit marker though, which isn't the worst. You know what is the worst though? My aim this game. I gotta go to mid. I, I can't. My aim is just not up to snuff. 
I want to cry. I <laughs> I am so bad. Oh, goodness gracious. There's a guy right here. I don't feel like we have any wall penetration at all, but we're still able to get him. We pick that kill up. We keep going. What about over here? The uh, visual shake from that score streak just messed me up, but we still got him. Pre pre aim, pre aim, pre aim. I ah, can't pre aim that, can I? <laughs> I also, I think in previous games they've tried to make gold a bit too. That'll be fun to do it. A bit too realistic, where they'll have like parts of the guns that aren't covered in gold. I don't have a rocket. I I know like a million people run rockets. I just ask so nicely for someone to. Regardless, what I'm trying to say here is that I like the way they did the gold this game. It actually feels gold. Um, it's not, you know, only a fourth of the weapon is gold because they're trying to be realistic. What do I call it a VTOL? It never gets this many kills. I also feel like it's only killing me. No, it just killed God. Uh, so we have a... It must be... We must have Nietzsche on the other team. So... Looks like they actually got it now. Which, hey, you know what? I could have swapped to a rocket. You can edit your class mid-game. That's on me, I guess. There's also a glitch with the VTOL on the right show, I think, where you can get God mode. But I also think they're banning for that. Because people are like, bro, just use what's in the game. Uh, who cares if it's a glitch? It's like, that's not how that works. If, if, I thought I was dead, I can't tell in the flash. There's just so much stuff going on. We are performing terribly this game, that's okay. What is, what else is hitting me? They're all watching this long way, which I can fight, but I would rather stay a bit more close range. That's a teammate. Uh, the hard point's over here. I saw him in the back. I know there's another one just right here. Where are you? There he is. We got him. Let's see, can we throw our Simtex in there? Oh, why are you just on the floor? I guess that wasn't a window I threw it out. I could have sworn it was, but maybe I'm just stupid. He should... I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. I need Tack Mask. I, and I, you know what? I guarantee in the next three videos, I'm not going to have Tack Mask. I'm not going to remember, and I'm going to complain about it in every single video. Let's see. We have no, like, quote-unquote advanced movement here. Didn't even pick up the kill. How unfortunate. I do make a joke every time I see someone using a gold weapon. I'm like, what are you doing actually using your gold weapon, man? You're supposed to go on to the next one. You're not allowed to enjoy what you've unlocked. Why are there 20 grenades in there? I'm actually losing it. Holy cow. At least we're at the hard spot now. Hard point. Um, <laughs> let's see. Can I get anything back here? I know I should be probably, probably properly head glitching, but that seems a little too boring for me. I'll go ahead and throw the trophy system just so I can try to make my life a little less miserable. We'll get the points from holding the hard point. Sounds like there's some behind us right there. And what if we go back here? Are there more? Yes, but where? Where did he have a line of sight on me at? He's on point now. He walked off, so he... I hate it, man. I can't see anything. It's okay. Surely I'll get better. Look, I went from level 1 to 44 between the last two videos. Surely I'll just keep getting better at the game, right? <laughs> I am doing way better than I did my first video. If you haven't, I would highly recommend watching my first video if you want to see someone absolutely terrible. Now, of course, I'm still not the best. But it's actually pretty funny seeing just how bad I was doing and everything. <laughs> Again, believe it or not, I'm not that bad at aiming in Overwatch. I, I do play other games. And it's just... Something about COD, man. Something about it. I, if I was that guy, I'd be screaming at my screen right now. Or into my microphone. I do have voice chat disabled. In the future, I might turn it on just so we can hear the enemies. Because it's funny to hear the enemies be like, Bro, no way! You should have died whenever you kill them. Uh, I think that would be good content. But at the same time, I don't want to hear slurs non-stop and have to go through editing and muting my video on certain parts so we don't get demonetized. Um, because I, for one, don't support slurs. I <laughs> I know I said it's like the 2010s playing this game, but I don't mean in those parts. But let's see. I do also like how long Hardpoint goes. Oh, I think I'm dead, yeah. I have no way of knowing if I'm dead during those times. They have another VTOL. Someone on their team is apparently substantially better than all of us on our team. I didn't mean to throw my... I didn't mean to throw my flash, but we got a hit marker, so there's someone... Why were you up there? Why are you there? Have you guys ever heard of the objective? Because that's what I'm trying to play here, and I feel like we're not having the same mindset on these things. Let's see, let's see. Uh, because I'm not aiming. I'm playing stupid. It's okay. <laughs> what is going on? Uh, this is also my, probably my favorite map. Um, I like the, the smaller, more close-range map. I really do. 
I feel like this game has a... I also don't... I, I much prefer Treyarch map design. And, and embarrassing, truthfully. Uh, I much prefer Treyarch map design, three lane. I'm simple, I like it that way. Uh, and this map feels pretty three lane-y to me. But then I play the car map, and I'm like, this is not fun to me. I play Raceway, I don't like Raceway. I think Raceway looks cool. I don't like Raceway, though. Is there anyone upstairs? No. Maybe we can, like, get it in from up here. Where is he? How did you know I'm there? <laughs> this is this is the bad game. <laughs> I take it back. Past, past ones, I've gone positive in all of them. This is the one I don't go positive in. Uh, but I have, again, I have gone positive in every game except this one, clearly. Why am I throwing the syntax? <laughs> I meant to... My fiance is next to me. She just went... Because she tries to be quiet whenever she's watching me sometimes. Uh, she couldn't contain herself that time. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's okay. Crazy idea. I just... <laughs> pretend this game never happened. You guys are none the wiser. Just record another one. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine I stop it right here. Video ends. <laughs> No, we're playing it out. Again, I don't mind too much. I don't mind doing bad. It doesn't... It's not sweat off of my brow. If you've made it this far, you're clearly not watching for the gameplay. Uh, I don't know where anyone is. I can obviously there's people on the hard point. Man, we got dominated. <laughs> Let's see how negative I went. We'll watch it. Oh, embarrassing. They also all are really high level. Not many low level people in this game, which obviously means that the skill based matchmaking is putting me into really hard matches. Um, because they're all so high level. That's all I'm saying. The skill based matchmaking must think I'm pretty good. Whoa, that is 16 to 31. Well, anyways, guys, I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And yeah, have a good one, everybody. Hold up. Let the game load so the video doesn't get messed up. But yeah, have a good one, everybody. Take it easy.